get in both the chapters. Okay, gravity. So gravity is that uh, you know that force that attracts to people. During learning this topic, um, I was I was I was absent for the whole time. So catching up to this knowledge was not that easy. But then later Ashok sir, who is a physics teacher and chemistry teacher, helped me and gave me extra classes to explain what is uh, gravity all about. Okay, the skills I think I have developed during this thing was mainly application by understanding the formulas and applying them and thinking critically about the questions and you know what we are actually doing. And it also helps in our uh, thinking skills uh, because you need to think and analyze a question properly. Over here you can go through the website and just see what kind of concepts are also Later, in uh, force and laws of motion, this is one of my favorite topics I feel because um, during we had a weekly test, I think I scored pretty well in these two kind of subjects. And uh, this uh, this thing help also helped in my same skills which I got in gravity, the th th critical thinking and also application. And also with that, I think uh, learning about laws of motion is important by knowing force because force you see everywhere. Okay, like uh, for example, if you want to keep up with the span up, gravity plays and even force is applied. So I think it's important to learn about this subject. Next. Coming to social. Social. Uh, it's all about you know uh, how humans interact with each other, how communities are built, how the earth is uh, you know built and is, is functioning, and um, also about how we the people live together. So history is one of those main things that we should know because with that past we can make a future brighter. Because if we understand what is our past and if we understand what kind of mistakes we did and realize from it, I think in future we might not commit those mistakes which is done in the past and learn from those. That's why knowing history is important. Over here, you can see uh, here is the uh, here is uh, we going to the Qutub Shahi tombs and this was a part of our history where the Qutub Shahi dynasty and that uh, the great rulers built their tombs. Then, in civics we have seen what uh, what is civics like uh, about the rights and duties, the rule of law and diversity. Like how over here even I have explained like what is rule of law, like how no man is above the law and how uh, no one has to like augment it because you know it's um, it's made for everyone. We see diversity also here, like everywhere you see they are diverse. Maybe some person is from Maharashtra, some person is from Uttar Pradesh, some person is from Tarantana, and that's called diverse. But then this doesn't mean that we, uh, you know, don't unite together. This, but then uh, if we have color in life, uh, means color in, in our whole world, there will be a, uh, you know, a bit better place to live. And even in geography, as this world is a very, you know, a delicate, not delicate, a very beautiful place to live, we need to learn how to conserve it also. So here is uh, the explanation about oil and environment as well, talking about how oil is required and what is soil for the environment, and also some few practices you can have to, you know, save oil. Math. Episode 3, Maths. So, one of very, you know, deadly subjects for people and most of the people fear this subject. Sorry, Papa. Um, so, uh, so, maths is that one subject like everybody can't escape. You no matter do what, you need to learn it. Okay, so, but then the main, my, what my father usually says, that practice is the main thing you need in math. So, over here, I have chosen the topic circles. I also hate because I don't really connect to this topic that much. But then, uh, circles is a one of those major topics that people needs to know. Because circle is everywhere. You see fans, you see coins, you see buttons. Without this, circles, without this, imagine having buttons which are square and uh, uh, having money as square as well. So here are some related terms on circles. 
and then we also learned we also learned about the theorems like how we apply like mainly the theorems are required for the architecture purposes and how you know to build some uh, to build some stuff and to build buildings this is where the theorems of circles comes in place so i think when i was learning this it really helped in my like you know a uh, drawing skill because you had to make a lot of circles for each and every problem also help in the application skills because you had to know the right uh, right theorem to use for a, a question and also we needed to learn also about the critical thinking to understand the questions a little bit of research as well to understand what's the proofs of each and every um, theorem English. So during English, we had a lot of speech speeches going on, and I think I was pretty good at it at beginning. But then I have no idea. Uh, slowly, I think I have been not been doing so well in my speeches. But then I will hope that I work upon it. So over here is one of my best speeches, which I gave because about uh, the good health and well-being. It we had focused on the SDG goals meeting. Those. the un sdg goals which we are aiming for 2030 to work upon them to make this place a very sustainable place to live next word clubs to improve our writing skills and you know our vocabulary we have word clubs over here i have written a word club to work because that's one of the recent trips i have uh, went and i think i wrote this uh, essay a very very good essay compared to the other essays which i have written Over here, over here we have a no, uh, we have an overview of the novel, where where I say what kind of uh, you know skills I have developed and what what more I have learned from the novels which we had, which is uh, uh, the Anthem Green Gables and also the Caravan to Zibel. So coming to Caravan to Zibel, we also had um, we also had a what is it? The literature fest, the literature fest. Where we had chose, we have read the book of Caravan to Zibel and presented it. Over over here is my group's uh, presentation on it. So it basically tells the summary. We also had different activities like uh, like how Arvita and Jashwan gave a uh, interview on this Caravan to Zibel. Later, later, later we also the new more stuff we did in English is that I wrote a poem on friendship. and also my drawings contributed in the uh, for the literature class here are my major um, you know my major achievements which i had in english like i uh, improved upon my vocabulary and also improved on my sentence formation and over here we can see how much major change happened uh, before the academic year that started and now after right now yeah so next एपिसोड फाइव हिंदी अभी हम लोग पहले से ही देख के आ रहे हैं कि हम लोग हिंदी हमेशा बात करते हैं जब भी ये वेबसाइट प्रेजेंट होता है हमने एपिसोड हमने सीजन वन और सीजन टू में भी देखा हुआ तो इस टाइम हम लोग फिर से सीजन थ्री में हिंदी लाएंगे तो अब हम लोग मेजर थिंग हम लोग सीखे हैं इस साखी आई मीन हम लोग साखी लास्ट टाइम भी सीखे हैं ग्रेड एट में पर हम लोग इसको ज्यादातर और समझ के सीखे हैं ओवर इधर इधर सब साखी के मेघ सब साखी के अर्थ और उनके नए शब्द हम लोग यहाँ लिखे हुए हैं मैं अपनी ममता मैम को धन्यवाद करना चाहती हूँ क्योंकि अब मुझे नहीं लगता मुझे ये साखी समझ में आता अगर वो होती और ये साखी सब तो हिंदी में हिंदी में शायद 
ममता मैम को सबसे बड़ा हाथ मिलना चाहिए क्योंकि तो उनके वजह से कुछ मेरा हिंदी नहीं हो पाता मेरी मम्मी हमेशा डांटती थी कि मेरा हिंदी ना बहुत खराब है और अभी भी है पर ममता मैम ने धीरे धीरे सुधार दिया मेरा हिंदी फिर ओके तो ये तो हिंदी था लास्ट एपिसोड people demanded for so what we had is that uh, education and uh, intelligence so here we uh, here in uh, in this kind of classes we had our uh, different you know we learned about uh, why you know we why bullying is harmful like how to uh, control our anger and stuff like that and i think because of that all of us have idea how to deal with situations later we also focused on how to choose our career paths like we have we got exposed to different career paths to choose and at last my uh, my group and i we did a presentation on it later souls souls is something that build a character and is introduced due to this year this basically helps us to you know build, see what we are and see what we can become and because of that we also focused on the three uh, the four main elements which are the learner profile approaches to learning cultures and mantras of mahatmas by this one could reflect like how great they are and how they can be could be good so i think uh, this gave also a spirit that if you get an uh, if you get a d at first people aim for c so that spirit uh, helped people to develop their character and during icts the first term we had it uh, we had we learned about python and ai and later on after few classes we also did a smart home uh, which we um, which a group uh, which our group made and over here you can see there's a layout of it later in arts my favorite subject so it's like um, we learned so technically when we think of art it's basically about copy and pasting stuff but i think when vishal sir explained it it wasn't that easy because you need to know what's the, the texture what kind of you know waves you have to use and uh, stuff like that and uh, art helped us and we understood what contour lines means and uh, we also did a lot of uh, you know drawings with that later uh, in sports as i as i played basketball and you have seen in the season 7 uh, the first and second season i love playing basketball so uh, we i also had uh, i really because of the lockdown i really didn't improve that much but then sure i went to different, different tournaments for playing basketball so as this uh, season is ending the season 3 i would like to thank my uh, friends who contributed uh for uh, you know giving me support in everything they did then my teachers explaining everything and you know giving all being always ready and helping me uh, help my, to improve my mistakes also my parents and my uh, brother that was in that time so even them to give me uh, a moral support and also being there my, uh, like always in the side so i hope everyone is ready for the, the next term because now project graduation is done so i think everybody is ready for the term two exams the students writing the exam the teachers correcting the things and uh, parents seeing the results <laughs> so at last thank you